The much-awaited Fertilizer and Soil Health Summit finally kicked off in Nairobi with participants calling upon farmers to use data to improve their farming methods. The summit seeks to highlight the crucial role of fertilizer and soil health in stimulating sustainable production in Africa. Dennis Otieno is attending the event and filed the following report. Kenya's capital is once again a beehive of activity as it plays host to the African Union's Africa Fertilizer and Soil Health Summit. The event, which has drawn together over 4,000 participants, has brought to the fore the significance of data in the agricultural value chain. There's a lot of soil data that you can work with because uh, soils that have more carbon are known to hold more water. So high carbon soils can, are actually resilient to, to, to things like drought and floods as well. 20% of our country is only arable. The rest 80% is not. So we have to maximize as much as possible this 20%. And furthermore, 63% of the 20% is acidic soils. So we have to really invest in soil amendments to make sure that the pH is right. Africa has 60% of the world's available arable land. However, soil quality has declined over the years due to excessive chemical fertilizer use and climate-related factors. Participants say data coupled with sustainable farming practices are key to reversing the trend. Also through the elements of agroecology that are also, um, I mean, among them, I mean, uh, you know, the, the perspective of the climate change adaptation, I mean, biodiversity, and also to ensure that uh, at the nutritional level, I mean, uh, all um, communities can be also, I mean, be safe under these perspectives. This is an opportunity for public-private partnership to collaborate and bring this data in an actionable manner across the country, especially in the most affected counties. To be sustainable, you first need to ensure that you increase your yield. That's your first point. From there on, your soil health focus is primary. The three-day summit under the theme Listen to the Land will be key in driving Africa's soil health transformation for the attainment of food security and economic growth. Soil fertility depletion has been cited as the fundamental root cause of declining per capita production. We want to take our continent to achieve you know, our agenda, the objective of our agenda 2063, and also the global agenda, which is the agenda uh, 2030, which is the, uh, uh, the, the uh, sustainable development. As Africa continues to bear the brunt of climate change, a review of its fertilizer and soil health is timely. By the end of the three days, stakeholders hope to agree on an action plan that will enable small-scale farmers rebuild their soils and increase productivity. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV, Nairobi.